stay at home order is putting a major strain on local business owners who have suddenly found themselves without customers. So mother and daughter in Boulder wanted to help out. McKelly White found out more about their new project that is helping keep local alive. McKelly, so many people stepping up in this time of need. They are, Dominic, and it can be easy to get into a funk when you're stuck inside for days on end. But yes, that mom and daughter in Boulder, they created a company called POW years ago. Uh, it means go in Greek. It encourages people to get on their feet, to get moving. But the way you do that nowadays looks a little bit different. So once Santa, uh, Sarah and Anna Zervo saw the huge impact coronavirus had on their travel-based business, they started a new initiative and website called Keep Local Alive. Now, when you go to the site, it asks a simple question, what can you do today while you're stuck at home? The site helps people navigate through various small businesses that are offering some unique services. It's city and virtual based, and there are 80 businesses in 12 cities worldwide. Now, Sarah tells me, even if you're on the fence, it's worth a try to support those small business owners, and you could be surprised with what you find. My 80-year-old mother-in-law, and she went on, and she's sitting you know, very nervous in this uh, independent living environment, right? And she's like, I can't go outside. She went on and she's like, are you kidding? I can, I can go see that museum or I didn't even know that museum existed. I, you know, she will never travel to Norway again, but she could see you know, a, a museum that's doing a virtual tour there. And this is a worldwide effort, as you heard. And if you're a small business owner looking to get the word out there, just head on over to cbsdenver.com. We have information listed for you there to connect with the Zervos family. For now, we're live in Denver. McKellia White covering Colorado first. Yeah, pretty innovative. McKellia, thank you.